Well, after an interesting day at the hospital yesterday, uh, six or seven hours waiting for poor Sandra, um, she's got a giant kidney stone and she's got to go back on Tuesday. She's been given painkillers and everything, so at the moment she's laid up in bed. Uh, and Paul and I are up here about to return the boards that we were lent to make the concrete foundations because they need them back. So we've managed to complete the barn here and the, hay, uh, the barn for the goats and the hay barn but we've yet to start the foundation for the milking parlour which is the most important bit but because the goats aren't, uh, well they're pregnant because they're not in birth yet that's not so urgent because the mums won't be giving us any milk so it's not too bad if we wait a little bit to get the four of the boards back again. So. Molly's boyfriend's dad's farm and this is one of his lady cows he's got. She's okay isn't she? Yeah I won't get any closer. Yeah. She doesn't look too happy to be on, you're going to be on YouTube?
Well, you pre dug the next one. I know, with the tyres, yeah. <laughs> Well, there's a little bit of rock lower down and it really stops the bucket digging. But they don't need to go in this far, this will be good enough. No, it's just about right, it's going to dig under. Goat playground. Well, we've managed to, Paul and I this morning have done over half of the hay shed foundation. I'm going to show you the what we've completed so far of the foundations. I think we've all got on really well actually. And the ground's got so much of a fall on it, going that way, obviously that end's taller so that's actually level. So this is going to be the barn for the actual goats. And then if I walk over here, oh, excuse the shakes, this is the hay barn. So this is the hay barn. We can load the hay in that door and then we can come out of this door and we can put the hay in the barn for the goats. So that's what we've done so far. We're going to start putting the pallets up the sides and uh, you'll see that in either the next bit of this video or depending how we get on it'll be safe for next week's video. But at the moment the goats are the most important thing for us to get sorted so uh, all our energy and time's going on building this probably not the best view for you all but unfortunately that's uh, life on a farm and that's what we're up to What's that inside of the tyre? Patches, they're repair patches. So you got this from our tyre man, who uh, we just go there and ask him for second hand tyres.
Right there, Stanley. Oh, Tilly out there guarding them, keeping them in a group. Come on, Till, Stanley, come. Come on, Tilly. Hello. Good girl, Tilly, sit. Tilly, sit. Tilly, sit. Good girl. Come say hello. Yes. <laughs> you silly girl. Mm -hmm. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You're a good girl. You want kisses? Kiss, kiss. Goats play, Paul and I are going to get on with uh, the last bit of concreting on the hay barn. Hello, Eddie. Right, now we're going to go for something to eat in Castillo Branco. <laughs> Hola, buen día. Tú es media sagre, es un mini, es por tres los menus, por favor. Está bueno, espectacular. Los medios son minis. Sí, sí, por favor. Muy bien, paz. What? Sí, me. Un total de breakfast. Yeah. to begin with, aren't we, just to size everything up and uh, Now we're going to trim off the excess on the end of the boards Just like that. You on the end? Uh, a bit more. Just a bit more. How's that, mate? You want to come back to me? Right. Okay. Yeah, we've got to square it up yet. Yeah. Yeah. See, what we do is we set that right with a bracket. Yeah. And we can straighten it, put one in the middle, one up, run, it, run this down the edge here, and we'll cut it up to that, eh? Does that make sense? One bracket, get yours pretty much, we'll get everything roughly in line by eye. That's about right. Yeah, just pretty much straight. There'll be a tiny little bit of wiggle room, so let's get a bracket in there. Good, but anything hard, they struggle. 